Flo says, did I miss the backlog? Oh wait, I can't hear that. Backlog, 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 backlog! backlog, backlog, backlog. backlog. Yeah, then. Why can't, why can't we hear it? I don't know, man. <laughs> Take a week off and all of a sudden everything's fugazi. Guys, it's backlog time. Yeah, it's hey, time for right. the backlog. This is a show where we reach into our backlog. <laughs> Every game we've ever bought, game. we put into an Excel spreadsheet. And today we're going to pick one at random and talk about it regardless of whether or not we've played it. We're up to nine. 963. Three. Okay. Because I went to Target and took advantage of the clearance section of video games. I'm going to have to go back and get some more, man. $5 for Mortal Kombat 11. Hell oh, yeah, my good Lord. All right. We're picking number 63. 63. Oh, so close to being nice. Tony Hawk's Pro Skater for the Game Boy Color. Ooh. This game sucks. No. <laughs> this game I is bad. I played a lot of this game. I know. Well, I, that's the problem with a lot of Game Boy games. Like, that's all you had. This on, was like road trips and stuff. This was one of the big. No, this wasn't a big one. Was it a big one? It was a clear one. Oh, it was just a regular clear Game yes. Boy Color game. Yes. Okay. <sighs> yeah, that is the problem there. Oh, yeah. This game yeah. sucked. It's, I remember this. Now. Yeah. Wasn't like, there like downhill stuff? Yeah, there was a racing mode. There were two modes in this game. So the, this didn't even try to emulate like regular Tony Hawk's Pro Skater. Um, there were two modes in this. There was a a race mode and then this vert uh, uh, vert pipe mode. And that's it. Neither mode is very fun to play. No. <laughs> uh, it it was it wasn't even try to be like a Tony. I forgot the game that it was actually like ripping off. I want to say. California games, but I don't think that's right. That sounds right. Yeah. This top down looks like the old uh Back to the Future for the yes. NES. Yes. Yeah, plays And that's not a compliment. No. That game also is bad. I mean, at least in this you could do like tricks and stuff like you can grind, you can do like uh kick flips. If you go off of a of a ramp and like you do a trick, mm -hmm. it'll like freeze frame on a picture of your character doing a trick. However, all the characters except for Tony Hawk and Alyssa Steamer look exactly the same. They're just <laughs> dudes in hats. So am I confusing this with a Game Boy Advance game that we had? So we never we only had this and Tony Hawk 2 on Game Boy Color. The the Tony Hawk games on Game Boy Advance were 3D isometric games. Right. Yeah. Those, yeah, I'm thinking of that. Oh, I remember this more. This is Tony Hawk 2. This is Tony Hawk 2, and yeah. I remember this more. This was a better game. Better in the biggest asterisk you can think of. Because uh, this actually tried to be a Tony Hawk game. The Tony Hawk games on Game Boy Advance are like actually pretty popular. I never liked them. I thought they were all bad. This is what most people think of when they think of Tony Okay, Hawk that actually Hawk. looks pretty good. Yeah, for the time it was, I just couldn't get my head past like the the isometric look. Mm. Of this it. just looks like Tony Hawk on on the Game Boy. Yeah, like, that's that's what Tony Hawk probably should have looked the, like. So, I'd imagine that Tony Hawk Two was probably better on the Game Boy Color. Tony Hawk One looks like garbage. It was it was better on the Game Boy Color. You know, it, it was still wasn't good, but like that was at least trying to be a Tony Hawk game. Uh, this game, according to Wikipedia. The Game Boy Color version was developed by Japanese company uh, Natsume and released on March 30th, 2000. The Game Boy Color version is an adaptation rather than a true port. Due to the limited capacity of the platform, the game offers two gameplay styles. An overhead view with vertical scrolling and a side-scrolling view, which, uh, which there is a ramp on each side. There are four gameplay modes in which the player can only perform a few tricks. In half-pipe mode... Uh, the player must attempt to achieve the highest score possible. Tournament mode is a five-level vertical scrolling game in which players must race against three computer-controlled skaters and achieve the highest rank. Jumps are made automatically when the player maneuvers onto a ramp, and tricks are displayed in brief static image. Verse mode and rival mode are identical to tournament mode, except the player plays a single level against a single opponent. The opponent in rival mode is computer generated, uh, while the opponent in versus mode is human, uh, which necessitates the use of a link cable. There is no Metacritic that I can find for it for this game. Yeah, I don't think anybody reviewed it. I, this is one of those. This is at a weird time when, like, you know, Game Boy Color games would come out. Found the IGN like, review five. There you go. Uh, <laughs> game rankings gave it a sixty-three. Okay. Which is the lowest, that's a lower score than the N-Gage version of Tony Hawk. How did we acquire this game? We probably, like, just, we wanted Game Boy games, and we saw there was a Tony Hawk for Game Boy. Mm -hmm. So, like, 
mom buy us this for christmas mm -hmm. so sh she did that's how we got it uh also you said it was made by natsume natsume yeah. uh they've been making the shitty harvest moon game are these the shitty harvest moon game yes. or are these the ones that people like no these are not the ones that people like oh okay yeah because that has a different oh, name it's, it's story of season yeah yeah so uh bad game yeah, don't, bad game. Don't get, don't get it. Uh, maybe the second one. Maybe the second one, if you're like curious. But like, no, there's like, there's a thousand ways to play Tony Hawk games, and this is not one of them. Get trying to see if the second one did any better. Oh, seven by IGN. There you they go. They liked it more. Yeah. So there you go. Play that one if you got to mm -hmm. play any of them. But don't play any of them. Yeah. How about that? Play it. Play an actual console Tony Hawk game. Yeah. Uh, guys, thanks for watching the backlog. We'll see you on the podcast. And if you're here for the podcast, stay. Yes. But if you're here on YouTube, goodbye. Bye.